Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to show with you guys how to make a delicious menudo. In case you guys want to know how to make this super easy and delicious recipe, just stay tuned and I'll show you how. Alrighty guys, so let's get started with our ingredients. So for the recipe we're going to need 5 pounds of honeycomb tripe, beef feet, 20 new Mexico chili pots, 4 chili pasillas, onion, garlic, 1 large can of pre-cooked hominy, three bay leaves, and menudo seasoning. So these are ingredients, now let's get started. Okay guys, so first we're going to start by preparing our tripe. So just make sure that you clean it and rinse it really, really good. And then you're just going to cut it for about, about one to two inches big. Okay, so once we have them ready, we're going to pour three quarters of a cup of lime juice. So that's about five to six limes. And then the rest, we're just going to cover it with water. And this is just going to take the stinkiness from the menudo. My mom usually lets it sit overnight, but we're just going to let it sit for at least two hours. And just make sure that everything is nice and covered. Okay, so we'll just be back once we let it sit for a while. All right guys, so after two hours, we are going to give our tripe and feed a quick rinse, and then we're ready to begin cooking. Okay guys, so after the final rinse, now we are ready to begin cooking. Okay guys, so we're going to grab a large pot. We're going to add about 16 to 20 cups of water. We're going to set it on high heat. And to that we're going to add salt. Our whole onion. A whole garlic head. And our three bay leaves. So we're just going to wait for it to come to a boil. All right guys, so once the water begins to come to a boil, we're going to throw in the feet. If you're using any. Along with the tripe. Okay, so now we're just going to wait for it to come to a boil. All right, so once it comes to a boil, we're going to remove the foam form on top of our broth. Just so like that, our menudo can be nice and clean and it doesn't have too much grease. All right, so once we remove that, we're going to reduce the heat to medium setting. We're going to add our menudo mix, or you can use oregano, and I'm just using two teaspoons. And now we're just going to cover it and let that cook for one hour and a half. Okay guys, so our menudo has been cooking for one hour and a half, so now it's time to make our chile sauce. So we're going to start by placing all of our chiles. So just make sure that you remove the seeds and place them in a small pot. Fill it up with water. Okay, set it on medium high heat and bring them to a boil. Okay guys, so once our chiles have come to a boil, we're going to turn them off. We're going to transfer into our blender cup. Okay, so now we are ready to make our chili sauce. Okay, so to our blender cup, we're also going to add two garlic cloves, one cup of pre-cooked hominy. Make sure that you rinse it really well. And then three cups of our water, or the chili water that we boiled the chiles. Okay, so now we're just going to blend until we have a smooth sauce. All right, so once we have our chili sauce, now we are ready to pour it in in our pot. Okay, so before we add our sauce, we're going to remove the onion. And the garlic. Okay. And now we're going to add our chili sauce. Now, of course, make sure that you strain if you need to. Just add it in. I'm going to get about a cup of the broth so I can get everything out of my blender. Okay. Just going to mix it. Okay. 
And at this point, we're also going to add our hominy. Make sure that you rinse it really well. Okay, so just continue mixing it. And at this point, try it for salt. Add it if you need to. And now we're just going to allow it to cook for another 30 minutes. Okay guys, so after our menudo has been boiling for 30 minutes, now you just wanna check your tripe in the feed and make sure that it is fully cooked. It should be nice and tender. And I also added some chile de árbol just because we like our, our menudo to be a little spicy. But at this point, our menudo is ready. So now we can go ahead and begin to serve. Okay, and now for the fun part, serving. Just going to grab a little bit of everything. And of course, if you feel like the tripe and the feet are still uh, tough, then just continue boiling it. Just continue cooking until it's nice and tender. The hominy is my favorite part, so I try to grab as much as I can. Okay, now we're ready to top it. Okay, so I'm just going to squeeze some lime juice. Okay. Going to add some chopped cilantro, uh, onion. Some chopped cilantro. Some more menudo mix. And because like I said, I like my menudo spicy, I like to crack the arbol and get the seeds. Okay, and I like to eat my menudo with bolillo bread and butter, but of course you can enjoy it with some tortillas. And just like that, we have our delicious menudo. Alrighty guys, and now for the best part, the taste test. Now let me tell you guys, I'm making menudo, it's seriously super easy. You know, of course a good menudo has to have a good uh, chili sauce. And let me tell you that this is seriously the best. So hope you give it a try and enjoy it just as much. So cheers and enjoy. Mmm, it's still a little hot, but let me tell you that it's seriously, it's super delicious. It's so good. Alrighty guys, and there you have it on how to make a delicious menudo. I hope you guys had enjoyed watching this video, and if you did, please don't forget to give me a big thumbs up, share with your friends and family, and if you regret this recipe, please don't forget to tag me in any of my social medias, and if you're new to my channel, please hit that subscribe button so you guys can be part of our family. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye.